New Zealand's black-billed gull numbers have declined by 80% in the past 30 years. With this in mind, Wildlife Management International Limited have been undertaking a groundbreaking study into the gull's life history so therefore can help reverse the decline and increase their future survival. The main aims of the study are to determine juvenile survival. So we as a team are monitoring the number of fledged chicks returning to the colony to breed. We are recording all banded gulls seen at the colonies, noting their breeding status and banding newly produced chicks. With this information, we are able to work out the number of chicks each year which survive to breeding age. We have recently just sighted the 5,000th banded black-billed gull, which is a pretty exciting milestone for us. Another aim from this project is to determine adult annual survival by recording the number of chicks that have survived to breeding age and return each following year to the colony to breed. Both of these population parameters are vital in determining what is happening to the gull population trends and to assist management decisions to help boost numbers. Within all of this, Wildlife Management International Limited are starting to gain a greater understanding on the national dispersal and wintering movements of this endemic. So the movements in the non-breeding season for the gulls. This has given us some really interesting information. For example, we know of one gull which each winter goes up to Auckland and Miranda to over the winter and then we continue to record it each breeding season back at the Clarence River mouth on the South Island. 